Good afternoon. Welcome to Hoyt's Kitchen. This afternoon we're going to make a Kool-Aid pie. Just a Kool-Aid pie. Any flavor you like, but just make sure it's, uh, it is sugar-free. First of all, I got to wash my hands. Uh, get my hands clean. And uh, it takes four ingredients for this pie. It takes uh, one eight, eight ounce container of Cool Whip. You put it in a bowl. And uh, make sure you get all your Cool Whip out. And uh, it takes a Eagle Brand sweetened Condensed milk. Condensed milk. And uh, you put that in the bowl. And uh, takes one 10 inch graham cracker pie shell and one, one uh, pack of uh, Unsweetened Kool-Aid. Let's see the pie. Sugar free. Alright, you put this in here and you mix this up good. What and kind of Kool-Aid was that? Lemon lime. Lemon lime Kool-Aid. So mix this up good. And while we're mixing this up, I want everybody to see our uh Biscuit and dough rollers. We've got plenty of dough rollers. They're Amish crafted. And we got some uh, uh, wooden ladles. I call them egg turners. I call them spatulas. Spatulas. <laughs> uh, and we've uh, got our cookbook. Uh, Everybody that wants a cookbook, Susie can tell you how to how to get anything we got. Just go to his website, www.hoitskitchen.com, and just scroll down. After you, after you hit Shop Now, just scroll down. It has, like, a lot of shirts and caps and stuff like that. And then you'll see, like, the biscuit cutters, the dough rollers, uh, the tea towels, the recipe books, um... And that way you, and they've lifted the quantity on there so you can get as many uh, cookbooks and stuff as you want. And I think as the other things as well. So. Just make sure you get this uh, mixed up thoroughly. And then uh, all you do is pour it in this 10 inch Pie, pie shell. That's pretty. Lemon lime. I mean, you could, the lady I got this recipe from, she made a mango. A peach mango. Peach mango, and she said it was really good. I made one. The other day, well, actually, I made two. I made a, a lemonade. Well, that was that was very good. Yeah, Susie liked that, and uh, then I made an orange and took down to the poles. So to the community center. Yeah, community center. All right, you put this pie in here and uh, smooth them out pretty good here. Then the next step is put it in the fridge for three to four hours. It won't last that long. Oh, me. <laughs> All right, folks. There's the reason my hands need to be clean. That's right. All right. 
Mm, that's pretty good. It will be good when it's cold. Mm -hmm. All right, you cover it. And you put it in the fridge for three to four hours. So anybody can make that pie. You keep watching and I'll keep cooking. God bless.